Okay, 8.7. So the veil's a bit closer, however, still that's not for me. And calibrate the sensor. And calibrate the veil as well. So the veil is closer. Six foot is slightly lower, but that, in terms of continuous glucose monitor, is something that I'm more than willing to accept. Um, especially considering I had a full night's sleep. So let's see how the rest of the day goes. See those three shaded orange areas. So there's one just as we saw earlier. Uh, about 11 o'clock and there's one foot and that was the point there where I turned all the lamps off the veo and then you can see there's another one at half 12 where it's suspended for about half an hour and then finally another one at about five o'clock in the morning and the beauty of that is I didn't I wake up there was no alarms and it just suspended you can see that then it it's rose back up, stayed nice and steady, a slight little bit, and it's gone again. So if this calibration comes in somewhere around the, anywhere between the six and eight mark, that for me means that I've had the first best, well, the first full night's sleep for quite a long time. Whereas if I had the veil on, you can see the same 12 hour profile. I would have had alarms here, 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 and here, which probably would have mean that I'd be now look even more tired than I do now, which wouldn't be a good look. So let's um, I always bowl this about 20 minutes before my breakfast to make sure that um, the insulin gets a chance to work before the, the carbs hits my bloodstream, otherwise I get quite a high spike in the morning. So, 8.7, use the bolus wizard, carbs, breakfast is going to be 60 grams carbs on the bowl of cereal. Okay, flip in. And then deliver. Okay, so a quick breakfast. Uh, scales, always wear my stuff, that way I get it right. The Vitality Flakes, that'll do. Okay, so I know that for each 100 grams of this cereal, that's 80 grams of carbs. And because I put in 60 in the bowl of Wizard before, if I, have, if I have 50 grams of these, which will then be 40 grams, and then I know 200 mils of milk is worth 10 grams, then I'll be all good. So. You can see that, well, you could see that, that was 50 grams. I put it on properly. Well, it is 50 grams, trust me. That's what 50 grams of cereal looks like. Okay, 200 mils of milk. Let's see how this goes later on. I just realised I can't do my maths because 50 grams of that cereal was 40 grams. 200 mils is 10 grams, that makes 50. I'll put 60 into the bowl of this it, so it looks like another 200 mils milk. Uh, 
I'll look for the calcium though.